Welcome back to Blab.Cafe. This is a place where you can introduce your business, products, and or services. Looks like I'm on here for 190 days today. So, and this is show number 90. So that's a good coincidence and it looks pretty good. So what I'm gonna do is get everybody straightened away and we'll get started. Thanks for joining. Slip if I don't go, they will not slip. Hi, welcome back to Blab.Cafe. This is a place where you can introduce your business, products, and services. Uh, today I have Bilge Jormes, also known as Sue Bilge. <laughs> How are you doing, Sue? Hi. Um, so your products are in the, you're in the, what's, what's the word I'm looking for? You're in the uh, industry of... Industry. Textile industry. Textile industry, yes. I'm sorry, that was not coming off. <laughs> That's okay. Yeah, okay. So, yeah, you're representing um, Turkey with the textile industry, and um, you got some really nice products. So, can you tell us a little bit about them? I'm going to try to do a screen share and show you, show the public what I'm seeing on your website. Okay. So, I'm going to try to get over there. You can go ahead and talk about them right now, and I will do a screen share here in a second. As I set this up. Um, hi, everybody. Uh, I'm from Turkey, Donald said, and we are production towels here. You should. This is handcraft, uh, Donald. We yeah. can see handcraft now. Uh, mm -hmm. Yeah. I'm production handcraft. I am making them myself, and I have a lot of women around me, and I am teaching them their production that they are for me and if you go to handcrafts in you will see a lot of kind of things okay. uh, I'm a toys and if you come to towels I can give info for towels Donald thank you this is real business as well uh, we are production in Turkey towels bed sheets a lot of textile but uh, I gave I would to give you some info about the towels now and uh, I would show you some samples Then okay. uh, they are, uh, I work for my customers in other countries. They are usually, how can I say it, for reclam, advines. Advertisement? Yes. yes. Thank you, Donald. I'm sorry. <laughs> no, that's okay. <laughs> so um, that's what you're doing now. I'm going to just go ahead and just pan over this. This is another thing that you're involved with oh, is uh, linens and then linen. also work clothes, work clothes. Yeah. So that's, that's yeah. really cool. I'm going to leave this over here on the towels window and then I'm going to do a transition out and come back over there. So let's get me back over here. Okay, cool. Uh, so was there a towel that you have that uh, you're working with that uh, can, did you have one that you were showing? Yeah, I would to show you some of them today. Okay. And then every production I will call in and then I will show you other 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 new products. Oh for okay, you. cool. <laughs> yeah. This is print towel. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, this is logo for my customer. This okay. is just a print. We give them color. Okay. On the towels. Mm -hmm. And then this is big towels. Oh wow, that is bathroom. Yeah, that's nice. What is that? That's a spa or sauna? Oh, my sauna and spa class. Okay, cool. Yeah. Is that a German company? Yeah, okay. German customer by it. The Actually, there is a one stockroom customers, and he has big big stockroom in there. Right. And then uh, he is getting a lot of small customers, right? Who they want that kind of logo, yeah. And then I'm working for them. Well, that looks and really then, nice. I like the quality. That's a really nice looking towel. Oh, yeah. very good quality. This is not very heavy towels because it gets really wet. Yeah. Because get the water very well, mm -hmm. and then. It the sauna has to wash it very very often because yeah. just one customer can use it, and then um, sewing should be really 
good. So they're washed. And they're then washed. it's washed, it shouldn't go up. Yeah, yeah. And print quality is the same if you can wash it very often. Yeah, okay. It's not a problem for print. Okay, cool. This is one of them customer. Oh, okay, yeah. So um, yeah. just to let everybody know, you can take orders from small orders to large orders and you can go into the thousands of towels with no problem and all the way down to say what 10 towels or maybe 50 towels or something like that but i i would imagine that if you're going to go for a printed towel with a logo then you want to really get some big orders because that takes time for you to set up the printing machines and to make sure that they're working and that the prints are coming out yeah, so that and make sense. the sample is really expensive as well. If it's prints, take the more time, and sample is so expensive because we are trying, we are making, we call it shablon. We are uh, scabalone. taking for scabalone. Yeah, shablon for all colors and all the spell, and then it takes a lot of time and a lot of money, and then. Mm. If it's good order, we make it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If it's not good order, uh, we are telling customer, would you like to pay it? It is really expensive to get Chablone, and then they choose. Yeah, yeah, that's good. But if it's amplitude, it's more easy for me. But that's the uh, thing too, is that's one of the things too, is you, if somebody came into you with an order, and it might be a smaller order, maybe only 50 or 100 towels, you could pay, maybe just give them an estimate of what the whole order will cost before they actually order it. So then that way they know, okay, the 100 towels with this logo is going to cost such and such dollars. So that, that I think is a pretty good deal. But I think what uh, people can do is go ahead and go take a look at your website because um, it's pretty cool. I like all, the, I like all your products. Thank you. Pretty nice. I am building it myself. I am trying to put every time new things and I am trying to write info as well about them. Yeah. But uh, sometimes I am not keeping time for it because I am sometimes so busy and then <laughs> I cannot put all photos in there. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's time consuming. But if my customer say to me, please put my uh, towels as well, I like to see it in the, your website, I am putting it as well. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Well, that's like free advertising for them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And for me as well. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Okay, so well that's great. Well, we'll get your links and we'll have people come over to your to your website and you're welcome to come in and jump in anytime. Thank you for joining, Sue. Thank you. Thank you so much, Donald. Good night. Hi, right, welcome back to the This is a place where you can business products and or services. Today we have Corinder, DJ Corinder Mali. How you doing? Oh no, I how are you? Good, good. Uh, so you have some new equipment and you have a new lab coming out, right? Yeah. Um it's like the final price party, which is tomorrow. Uh uh we've got seven if not. Corinda, do me a favor, turn your camera this way so that light that's coming over your shoulder is not so small. Move, move yourself and your camera. There you go, that's much better. Yeah, that, that light was really blasting in. Oh. So. Um, yeah, so what else? So, what is Simon's Point Party? Also, I have a social media show. So, if anyone interested in social media, then they will to show. I'll get your link. Yeah. I'll get the link for your upcoming uh, show. And then the subscriber page can be posted here as well. Oh, no. okay. Yeah, don't have much to talk about, but I'll try. Hi, uh, welcome back to Blab.Cafe. This is a place where you can introduce your business products and or services. Today I have Lee Kreider from the Ohio Ram Show on in the house. How are you doing, Lee? Oh, I'm doing all right. How are you uh, over there? <laughs> over there. <laughs> over there. In, uh, on the other side of the planet. <laughs> in that country that um, all our politicians here don't like, but 
<laughs> yeah, they're the ones that have never lived here for very long. Yeah, yeah, I know, I know, I know. Don't get me started. You, you oh, got to keep yeah. me off that subject. You know that, Donald. Yeah. What kind of uh, projects are you working on now? Well, I, I saw it pop in here and see what's going on because I am so gooey eyed from video editing. I don't know which ends up. I mean, uh, <clears throat> that um, it's uh, it's an obsession or it's a uh, like being on drugs or something. something. You um, you you get started and <clears throat> four or five hours go by and you wonder why your eyes are falling out on your cheeks and. Uh, and that sort of thing. But um, I've been doing a lot more editing with the show, uh, Donald, um, trying to sweeten it up a little bit, make it look a little better, uh, put some lower thirds in after the fact. And this is all India month on the show. Oh, okay, cool. So you've so, got all of the Indian riders coming by and talking yeah, to you? Yeah, um, uh, uh, the, the, the ultra cycling has been growing in India by leaps and bounds. And so um, I decided to make it an all India month. Um, and, uh, but what, you know, after you talk with people from India for a while, you understand them pretty well. People, but people complain, you know, I, I don't understand them. It's just, it's just like talking to somebody from Scotland, you know, they're hard to understand too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So I spent a lot of time putting lower thirds in, you know, with what it, what it is they're saying so people can. Oh, yeah, just it. like subtext. That's a good idea. Subtext, yeah. yeah. Subtext, that's a good I. That's what I should call it, you know. So that's what I've been up to. Um, we're showing some growth, not, not dramatic. I mean, we're, we're dealing with a very, very small clientele to begin with, you know. And it and, says you, you're thinking about adding another YouTube account. What was that about? Well, um, sometimes I have projects that I don't want to have in my normal uh, playlist or what have you. Yeah. And um, because I have subscribers and it's not stuff they're interested in at all. Yeah. So you're talking about the fact that you've got like a personal channel, but you've got both business and personal stuff on it. Yeah. Well, I don't put any personal stuff on there. Now I do have a Vimeo account, Donald, which I use. I like Vimeo a lot. Yeah. Um, but uh, the show's you know, all. I noticed about Vimeo, I was just over there and I was looking at their little payment plans and I realized right away that they do have a really cool plan. And at some point in time, I might even consider using it because the fact of the matter is, is there is a way that you can monetize your videos from the location where they're being played. So it's like if somebody wants to see your content and say you're doing a tutorial or something, you can actually generate an income from your Vimeo playlist directly on the playlist. So it's not like they have to go to a secondary pay, payment pl uh, plan to to pay for a view. But there are some people that are really like high end uh, movie producers, and they they produce these really high quality videos over there, and they charge like five dollars for some of them to get to, to view them. And I thought that's kind of neat, you know. It's like <laughs> for an independent movie maker, yeah, it's gonna make a small, um, yeah documentary or something you can well, do i think they, they do a real good job of rendering and yeah. i got to i'm going to get a headset on here i'm getting echo um they do a real good job of rendering um that yeah, I, I, do, I do i have a paid subscription yeah which gives me um the lowest payment it gives me more upload than i ever will use Thanks for stopping by the Blab.Cafe. This is Blab.Cafe number 90. This is a place for you to introduce your business products and or services. Uh, I've been on here for 190 days. So obviously in 10 days, we will be doing the 
100 number 100 show and i'll be on here for 200 days so that's that's going to be cool anyways uh thanks for stopping by uh we will see you manana bye bye